These are tourism sector association leaders meeting this morning for the first time under their umbrella organization, the Uganda Tourism Association. This meeting was uh, the beginning of a new era, a new chapter of putting people together. For the last two years, we've been struggling to bring the industry together. And then we start speaking as one voice. I'm glad that uh, Herbert was talking about a structure, a secretary that is actually functional with a CEO and a secretary and board minutes and accounts, USAID, DFID, international organizations that have supported the other sectors in Uganda, I'm sure will support tourism in Uganda. And they are always saying, we can't come to you telling you, please come, there's money here. It's you to come to us with proposals. Training emerged as the overriding need across the tourism sector, which now that the private sector has begun working together may become surmountable. Meanwhile, the slump in visitors from out of the country this low tourism season is awakening the need for promoting domestic tourism. But another thing that we are calling about, uh, we are calling for from UTB and all other bodies is domestic tourism because we have low seasons in our hotel. So I call upon the hoteliers that are here. When it's a low season, let's really reduce our prices and encourage people to visit our hotels. Lack of internal cohesion has undermined the private sector strength of the tourism sector, even while they keep pushing government to play its part. Someone said Tumba NTV, business.